Hi you guys, I have an empties video for you. So I've been saving up for a while. It seems like it's been a long time, but... Um, oh, I wanted to mention in here, I'm gonna be doing a video unboxing of something called the Booty Box. And it's like a yoga box. And this awesome scarf came in there. So be on the lookout for that video coming up. All right, so let's start off with this bag. I have a, two little bags. All right, so the first thing that I have here, this is from Preference L'Oreal. This is from a hair color that I had, oh gosh, eons ago. And I think I put it away inside one of my drawers or something, I don't know what happened. Or it was sitting inside of my shower thingy that hangs off the shower head. And I finally used it up, but this is um, comes out of one of those hair dyes. And this is awesome. I always say that all those conditioners that come out of those hair dyes are the best super conditioning you don't have to leave it in for quite a long time to get like super super conditioned super silky soft hair so i love them this actually i think is my favorite one so if they could sell this one i think i would buy it um next is from poise they no longer make this package um back in the day i purchased this i think i purchased like pfft, i think i had like 20 of them i think I'm getting down to just a few left, but you know, Poise, it's a feminine wash. If you can see there, feminine wash, it's really good. You know, it does its job. I can't say nothing else much about it. Mom, those are all empty. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I have been, although I'm not posting on Instagram, there is a sample, I forgot what it's called, We Mom Mandy is doing it over on Instagram. Uh, where you're trying to use up all your samples for this this whole year of 2015 so I am doing it but I'm not posting pictures but I'm trying my hardest to go through a bunch of samples um, so I do have a lot of little things in here um, so the next is the Olay fresh outlast this is one of them I have two more of these size and I got this from pinch me and it smelled nice yeah it smells really good um, it was okay it wasn't the best it's very like creamy like a lotion kind of a thing but it, I mean it was good it smelled good it says cooling white strawberry and mint um, so it was nice it smelled good and um, this is another one I think I got this possibly I don't know I think I I don't know where I got this I don't know but it was really good I think the Dove body washes are super moisturizing excellent really really good but the scent if I recall yeah, it was just okay. It smells like a lotion, which I don't prefer that for a body wash, but good. Oh, empty. Went through one of these toothpastes. Not much to say. I got tons and tons of Colgate. You guys should never pay for toothpaste. As a matter of fact, I got two Colgate Optic White today. Today is Sunday. I don't know when this is going to go up, but I got them both for free with couponing. You guys should never pay for toothpaste. Never. Never. Um, Smashbox Photo Finish, more than, this is the blemish control one. I got this maybe, it could be more than a year ago. I won it on their Facebook page. So I do have another one I got in a swap with um, Freebie Ninja. So, but this one's completely done and it did its job. I really liked it. And um, it has 2% salicylic acid in it. So I really like this one. This one was really good. It's more like, um, it's in between, there's like a tiny bit left in here. It's in between like a silicone and a lotion consistency. Um, it was nice. It smooths out the skin and it just, you know, it's a good foundation for your, your makeup. Oh, Andy. Um, this one, I cut the top off of it because I really liked it. I don't know where the top of it is. But um, this is the, is it Jergens? I think this one is the Jergens one. I, forgive me if I'm wrong. Um, okay, so this is the Body BB. This is in the light. Mm -hmm. It's supposed to give you a little bit color. Um, and as you use it every day, it's supposed to build up the color to your skin. I didn't see that. But it has like this strange smell that is very unique. And it reminds me of something. I think it's because it has that light scent of when you're using maybe like a self tanner maybe. I'm not sure. But I really like it a lot. And I'm so thankful that recently I was able to get a whole bunch of these for next to nothing with couponing. I think I got them almost free. Next in here is the Revlon Color Stay. This one is in 320 True Beige. This one is quite dark for my liking, but I always mix this with a lighter shade. So I usually have multiple shades of this exact same foundation, and I'll just put a little bit of this into a little bit of that and be done with it like that. So 
Um, there's just like, there's a, there's still a little bit in here, but I just couldn't get it out of the bottle and I don't have one of those scraper things. I know that um, I saw, who did I see? I think it was Cauliflower, that she got one of those scraper things in a swap and she was like, ah, what is this? Girl, if you don't want it, I'll take it. Gone. Next is, next is from Epice, uh, Epice, Epice blah, blah, blah. I don't know where it's from but this is what it is. Um, and that is what it's called. So you can pronounce it however you like. Um, this is just a face scrub. It's got um, like a, it's between a lotion with like um, a microdermabrasion feel to it. It's really, really great. I think I got this in my birch box if I'm not mistaken. Um, so it's, it's really, really, really nice. And it's just like this super fresh, clean feel. If you haven't used this or if you get a chance to use it, go ahead and try it out. I really like this a lot. It's really good. Next is from Biore. This is the Deep Pore Charcoal Cleanser. Um, there was a $2 coupon that came out, I want to say last week, for $2, the $2 coupon for $2. This is $1.99 at CVS. You can use that $2 coupon and get these for free. So I did get one last week and I'm planning on getting another one if I find it because um, I did find another coupon for it. But um, this is really great. It's like a gray, I don't know if you can see the color up there. It's like a gray color. And um, it has a really nice cooling minty feeling to your face. It feels amazing. You put it on in the shower and it just like opens everything up. It's awesome. It's really, really nice. It's like warm but cold at the same time. So deep pork charcoal cleanser. I highly, highly, highly recommend it. Okay. Next, this is the Vidal Sassoon Color Preserving Conditioner. Um, and this one here is came in another hair dye that I got from Buzz Agent. The hair dye was a complete fail for me, like the next day, not the next day, because I didn't wash my hair. Don't touch. Allison's behind the camera. <laughs> She's trying to move the camera. Don't move it. Um, now you made me lose my train of thought. Oh the color. I didn't wash my hair like the next day. I washed it like the second day or something like that. And at that I did use a color safe shampoo and conditioner and all of the above. And it took out the color instantly and my gray hair showed right away, which I hated. And this conditioner was really good, but um, I would never buy that. I would never buy it because I didn't buy them in the, in the first place. Um, Artistry, and I think that a whole bunch of people got that as a freebie coming up. So if you have gray hair, beware. You're not going to be happy with it. At least I wasn't. Next is from, I think this is like Mary Kay. I don't know. It says Artistry. Is Artistry some Mary Kay brand or something? I don't know. My friend gave this to me. My neighbor gave this to me a long time ago. And when I was cleaning out my drawers and all that stuff, I saw that it was still in there. So it's been there for quite a while. There's still like this much in there, but I think it's time to get rid of it. But it was really good. I just have, you know, I review so many products. I just forgot about this and it was just sitting in my drawer for a while. So it's time to get rid of it. I wanted to smell it. Next is, go ahead. Okay. Next is from Caress. And is this the one? This is the one. Every time I get this particular one, white peach and sil silky orange blossom. I say this every single time, but this time I'm not going to cry about it. This one reminds me of my mom. It smells like the, the original Caress. Caress Soap Bar, and I just love the scent because it reminds me of her, and it makes me think about good it, days and good and times. And it smells like her perfume. It does. Look here, I got two more Revlon Color Stay. That other, I forget what the other ones. This is two fifty and three ten. Um, so these are the colors, and you can see I got a light one and a darker one, and I would um, mix them together and get the shade that I prefer. Um, I just couldn't get any more out. I tried. Look at this one looks like I scraped it, but I didn't. I just kind of when I get down to the bottom, I put them on my vanity upside down, and whatever drips down, I can hope to get, and whatever doesn't, then you know what can I do? This glass, I almost broke them. <laughs> Next, let's see what I've got here. Oh, this I kept this forever, thinking that. I kept this forever thinking that I was going to go ahead and buy it, but it is so darn expensive. Um, forgive my nails. You're going to have to see my nasty nails right now. Um, this is the Tarte, what is it called again? 
emphasize, emph emphasize. Um, I got this with one of my palettes. I think it was with one of my first palettes. This thing is awesome. Pretty friggin' amazing. It goes on really nice, silky and smooth, and um, and it doesn't budge. It's really, really good. Super easy. I mean, you can just barely touch your eye, and you can get the perfect line with this. Um, but it's really, really pricey, so I did not ever pick it up. But if I could get it for an excellent deal, I probably would. Or not. Maybe in a kit. Next is um, Maybelline The Falsies. This is the flared version. This is not the original version. Um, this one was really good. It's just had its time and it had to be just hot out. <laughs> mascara. <So. laughs> Allison is so funny. Yes, it is mascara. So it's just had its time. It doesn't do anything for my lashes anymore, but I really did like it. It gives me a lot of volume. Mally Volumizing Mascara. I actually purchased this with my Birchbox points on birchbox.com and it's because I really wanted to buy this. Every time I see the late night, is it QVC or HSN, whatever it's on, I always wanted to get it because I always show these ladies and they put this mascara on and it's like kapow, like fake lashes. I'm like, can't be. And so I got it and I was disappointed with it. It did not perform like it did on TV. I don't know what they used in the one on TV, but this is not like the one on TV. It was good, Allison. It was good, but it wasn't great. I mean, I think drugstore mascaras performed much better. And that one's like $24. So I would not purchase that again. This one here is from L'Oreal. This is the L'Oreal Lash Out Butterfly Mascara. And, um, oh, by the way, let me see. Let me show you um, the wand on this Mally. It's just the typical mascara wand to also just to let you see what it's all about. But um, yeah, it, it didn't last very long either. It, like my other Sicker. mascaras, my other mascaras last a lot longer than that one did. That one didn't last long at all. Okay, so this Lash Out Butterfly from L'Oreal, it was really good. I liked it, but it didn't last very long either. Um, it has this weird wand and there's like, I think there's like a little tiny hole in it right here at the tip where it kind of bends up. Um, it did a good job. Um, I think the Carbon Black Mascara is the best mascara. I haven't had it in a long time. I just probably won't buy it because I have a drawer full. I think I have like 30 mascaras and packages right now. I need to put it up for swaps. Um, I have so much makeup that I planned on. I really want to do swaps. I just don't have time for it, to be honest. Um, so it was really, really good. I really liked it. I used it like day after day after day, and then I got new ones. So and it's time. Ooh, that's it. That's two bags full of over, over, overfilling bags. Ipsy bag, whatever bag. I got this from Ulta when I bought my Benefit. What is that? It comes in like this weird little thing and it's a powder and you can take off the little um, matte powder or something or another. I don't know what it is. I forget. Anyway, that's when I got this. So that is everything, you guys, for my empties. I hope those... Um, little tiny mini reviews were helpful and um, that's it you guys thank you so much for watching and I will see you again in another video bye